All right. Okay. Good evening, guys. It is February 26th, which is absolutely insane. So I know we are wrapping up Team Cut Month, and our team had a couple people lock it in today. We are doing awesome. So I just want to um, quickly introduce you guys to Keyshawn Graves. I, oh my gosh, we started kind of working together years ago when I was a different, I think it was a diamond, and that's when you used to work with diamond coaches because there weren't so many in the organization. And then she kind of mentored me for a while, and then she got relocated to a different region. And then we went here, we went there. In the beginning of the year, I got a message from her, and she's like, I'm back in the South, and this is Central Region, and I'm just so blessed to be able to reconnect with her. Um, she's been an amazing, she's just wonderful to have at corporate. Um, and she asked how she could support me, and I said, if you could help my team and support them. So she agreed to do this call for us and i'm super excited because she is going to talk about the road to elite and i'm going to leave it at that i'm just going to let you take the take the reins okay perfect i'll take the baton from here coach y'all first of all this is like this is kind of a full circle moment because like christine mentioned we've been working together for for quite a while and we took a little bit of a of a leave of absence, so to speak, but we've talked about this team and we've talked about um, the impact that you guys all have set to make together. And it's kind of full circle just seeing the faces that make up the team and make up the lives that you guys are collectively touching, starting with your own and starting with your own family. So it's cool to see some names of people that we talk about weekly and talk about your successes and talk about your goals and talk about how we can help you get to the attainment of your goals. Um, so thanks for having me here. And, and we're all busy and so I'm I'm excited that you guys are here and doing this for yourselves um, with the hope that you don't allow this conversation to end here in this conversation. Um, time is one of those precious investments that we'll never give back. You know, so it's very important how we use it. it can, we'll, we'll never give, it, we'll never get it back, but it can give back exponentially if we use it properly. And so, my my hope is that we take the the, the tips from this conversation and you go out and implement them. You take some of the um, the things that I'm going to talk about, and you and you you figure out they align with who you are and where you want to go, and then actually strive to 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 reach those things. So, anyway, just thanks for having me here. I'm super honored to be talking to you guys, but also congrats to you guys for showing up. This is step one. Step two is then implementing what you know. So, I'm going to be talking about the road to elite. Before I get started, just be just so I can better understand who I'm talking to. Who is like within the last year new? by a show of hands, or you can type it in. Okay, so JC, okay, uh, Abby, Hillary, Alicia, you guys are more than a year older in this matriculation? Okay, perfect, that, that helps me. My next question is, who has seen the Champions Page training on Road to Elite? Okay, so just, just okay, so about a handful. Okay, so good, so that helps me understand how deep I should go into these conversations. <laughs> Let me start by sharing my screen really quick. And I'm gonna just jump into this Road to Elite. Um, but as I present the Road to Elite, I really want you to keep your goals at the forefront of your mind. And I'm not talking about your beach body goals right now. I'm talking about your personal goals. What is it that you are personally needing or wanting to reach? And then we'll begin to identify what beach body goals we should be pursuing in order to reach your personal goals. And, that, and, and my hopes is that by the end of this conversation, you realize that in order to reach your personal goals, it will require ending somewhere along the road to elite. Okay, so I'm gonna start by saying I'm a naturally assuming, which is always scary to assume, that we're all here because we have this collective mission to help people achieve their goals and live a healthy, fulfilling life starting with their own and beginning to help other people do the same. And that's exactly what you guys are doing. And so this team is, is on the front line of creating those transformations, uh, those physical transformations, that mom who wanted to get her pre-mom body back, the uh, college 
recent graduate who graduated with her freshman 15, the dad who wanted to be able to catch up and, and keep up with his kids. You know, these are the stories. Um, the person who was severely uh, overweight or obese and, and needed to get a hold on their health and, and with ailments that have plagued their family for generations. Um, I mean, just so many amazing stories that I've heard. And, and this is what you guys are on the front line already of doing. Of, of helping to create these physical transformations. Now, I, because we're here, we, I'm assuming that we're all here to help people reach their goals and, to, and achieve a, help, a healthy and fulfilling life, we can kind of check that off. The difference between what you are already doing and what people who will end this year a leader premier or people who will end this year somewhere on the road to elite is that they are taking it one step further. And their goal is to help people achieve their goals to live a healthy, fulfilling life in a way that transcends beyond just health and fitness. And so the goal is to go from just transforming a life physically to transforming a life holistically. And so maybe it started out with that physical transformation, the, the, the need to get out of that eating disorder, uh, the need to gain weight, to put on muscles, whatever it may be and how we're helping our coaches and our customers. But then we've seen that there's opportunity for more, for an opportunity for us. And, and you'll hear me say this until I literally turn blue we have an opportunity to end trends, plural. And, and it's starting with the trend of obesity, but we also have the, the opportunity to end the trend of living paycheck to paycheck, which seven out of 10 Americans do. And even if you're coming into this opportunity with, with income, with, with all the things that you've been striving for your entire life, um, but without the freedom, we're also ending the trend of, 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 of having bound boundaries around your freedom. You get to just define what that means for yourself and for your family. Uh, you get to, we have the opportunity to help people put their kids in, in after school programs and, 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 and sports and, and music and art that maybe we weren't afforded as a child ourselves. We get to donate to our charity of choice um, in a way that is, that fulfills our hearts that much more than, than maybe our six figure income could do or maybe we were able to give the income donate to our charity of choice but maybe we weren't able to donate our time because we didn't have it and so one of the biggest things that people who will end somewhere along this road to a leader doing is they are helping people achieve their goals to live a healthy fulfilling life in a way that transcends beyond just health and fitness we are helping people holistically. We are ending trends. That's the opportunity that we have by striving to end somewhere along this road to elite. And so if your mission is anywhere aligned with that mission, if your goal is anywhere near you want to build a sustainable, lucrative business, then your goal should also be to end somewhere along the road to elite. Now, I'm not here to, to set goals for you. I'm not here to, 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 to push goals on you. I'm here for you to, 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 to stretch you, to identify what your personal goals are, and then begin to identify what beach body goals you need to be striving for in order to reach your personal goals. But I will say this. I've seen people come in uh, brand new in January, brand new in March, and end the year as an elite. Team. I, I've seen I've seen these things happen and so just know that it's totally possible for you to end this year right here wherever you're at however new or old you are however many people you did or didn't enroll last month you can do it and and if your goal is again to build a sustainable lucrative business then you should strive to end somewhere along the road to elite. If your mission is aligned with helping people achieve their goals and to live a healthy, fulfilling life in a way that transcends beyond just health and fitness, then your goal should be to end somewhere along the road to elite. That's what this is all about. And this program wasn't created to just throw spaghetti at the wall and see what our coaches do with it. It really is aligned with everything that I've mentioned, with building a sustainable, lucrative business, with building a team and helping them in trends for themselves and for their own life and begin to build a legacy for themselves and for their families and, and teaching them how to help do the same, to duplicate. 
And so as while I'm not going to be talking about elite, so to speak, during this conversation, but more so ending somewhere along the road to elite, here are just a few reasons in addition to what I've already mentioned as to why you should push for elite. Because it does mean that we're helping in trends, plural. Because it does mean that we are building a sustainable and lucrative business. Sustainability is so important, y'all. <laughs> like because we know that we can we can make some money impacting lives like that's one thing i love about this about this business that you can come in right away and you can roll up your sleeves and you can impact lives and you can earn an income in your business right away which is like that is not common in entrepreneurship <laughs> So that, that's cool that we get to do that. But what I want for us is to build something that's more sustainable. And what this program, this Road to Elite program sets you up to do is just that, build something that's sustainable. Um, but in addition to those things, here are some other things I'm not going to read because you guys are intelligent. I'm not going to read off this, but these are some reasons why elite should be something that you push for. And I'm a proponent of, of, of setting audacious goals and fighting like heck to, to reach those in the lives that you're impacting. But if we fall short, we're doing backflips because we know that we gave it our all. As long as we know that we gave it our all in the way that we define what our all is, then that's all we can do. Um, there's VIP access, to, meaning VIP access to help you build your business, uh, VIP access to uh, um, uh, super trainers. We're, we're doing another round of, of calls where our super trainers are, are hosting them, leading them. And guess who we go to? We go to elite teams first. We go to premier teams first. Um, there are also, as we're talking about building your business, opportunities to connect with our C-suite, with Carl. Carl's doing calls right now, one-on-one -on -one calls with elite coaches. He's doing one-on-one -on -one calls with elite teams, um, premier teams. Um, there's a special access to coach relations to help you build your business. You know, there are some amazing business building opportunities that come because you and your team are elite, because you're leading an elite team. There's also some financial um, 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 components involved with it too. There's a bonus and this is a monthly bonus. Every, every coach, every coach who leads an elite team earns at least a hundred dollars. If they're in the top 200, they earn an additional $400 for a total of $500 per month. And there's some caveats in there, meaning they have to earn success club, which is something that you are going to do. And, and they have to be paid as five star, which is the rank necessary to, to, to reach that bonus. But $500 a month just to do what you were already going to do in the first place <laughs> and impacting lives in the way that you've identified you want to impact lives to reach your personal goals and to reach your business goals. But more than all that there's a confidence there's a confidence that comes with leading an elite there's a confidence that comes with being on an elite team and you guys you guys should feel that sense of, of confidence knowing that you're on a team that knows the way and has the resources and goes the way and so hey even if you're brand spanking new and you're not quite sure what the way is you can say to whomever you're bringing in I'm kind of figuring this out too, but let me tell you, my team, they got it going on. And we have the resources, we have the tools, we have the know-how, we have the belief to help you, to help us get to where we're trying to go. And so already, you guys should have that belief in yourself. And then there's a confidence that just takes it to the next level when it is yourself, when it's you leading your own uh, uh, elite or premier team, or it's when, you're, when you yourself are leading a team that ended somewhere along the road to elite. There's a confidence that comes with saying, I am helping myself and I'm helping other people and I'm helping them in a way that goes beyond just health and fitness. I'm helping to end trends. And even if I'm nowhere near where I want to be, when it's all said and done, I got you right now. And so be, use that, leverage that. And so I, I won't keep belaboring this, but just know that elite is something that you can do, regardless of how new you are or what work you put in, if you decide to do it. And, um, and, and, and these are some reasons why, but I think that, some of the, the things that I outlined before I kind of got into this slide, those are the most important pieces. That helping people in a way that transcends beyond health and fitness, that uh, confidence, 
that building a sustainable, lucrative business. I've talked to coaches middle of the year, end of the year, who had no clue that they were contending to lead an elite team. They were just doing the work. They were just doing what they know they needed to do to build a sustainable, lucrative business. So if you don't remember anything from this conversation, <laughs> just know this, that if you sit down and you put your head down and you focus on three things that will drive your business, period, chances are you will get close to ending somewhere along this road to elite. And those three main drivers are acquisition, retention, and duplication. So the, the, the leadership ladder is something that we've now incorporated into the road to elite. So if you were around when we had the, the former leadership ladder, it no longer exists. It's now a part of this, which I love. It makes so much sense to me. And, and hopefully it'll make sense to you guys too. One, incorporating the leadership ladder into the road to elite now allows us to really talk about volume. It allows us to talk about income. When I asked you guys at the beginning of this conversation to keep your personal goals in the forefront of your mind throughout this conversation so we can identify what Beachbody goals, this allows us to talk about your personal financial goals and, and where we need to be in the leadership ladder in order to begin to see the fruition of those personal goals, those personal financial goals. Um, so the leadership ladder incorporation into the road to elite really allows us to talk about volume, to talk about maximizing our volume, and to talk about income as it relates to what you're wanting or what you're needing to accomplish. But the road to elite itself is a road with four benchmarks. And these four benchmarks include team builder, team leader, premier, elite. And so as I've been talking to you guys, um, my, I've, been, I've been wording it to where the goal should be to end somewhere along the road to elite. And so this is what I mean by that. So by the end of the year, to have ended either at team builder or team leader or premier or elite. And again, it goes back to if our goal is to build something lucrative and sustainable in a way in, in a way that's built off of impacting lives holistically then that is why we want to align your personal goals with these beach body goals so how do we do it the first benchmark is team builder and team builder is diamond rank for six consecutive weeks so if your goal was to hit diamond by summit or i don't know diamond by next month I don't, I'm not here to set goals for you. I'm here to stretch you, but I'm not here to set goals for you. If, if that was your goal, then my pushback for you would, would be, no, no, no. Let's not just hit diamond. Let's hit team builder. Why? Because team builder means a few additional things that diamond doesn't mean. Diamond means you have eight coaches. Two of them are emeralds, right? A diamond who is a team builder not only has those eight coaches, two of them are emerald, but they have at least one new emerald. So they are bringing on new people, leadership duplication, who are advancing in brain, but they also have team volume on their weak and strong legs, a thousand to be exact. And so this 1000 volume on your weak side for five consecutive weeks, excuse me, any five weeks. So it's a total it's a total of, of 1,000 for or five weeks. Let me make sure I say that right. Not, not 1,000 every week in the five weeks. If that doesn't make sense, let me know because I said it kind of weird. But it's 1,000 for the, for the five weeks, but that translates to income. That's on your weak leg. That means that your strong leg is stronger. That means that we're going to be pulling at least 10 cycles from that side in order for them. And it still does depend on your strong leg. Absolutely. But we have the opportunity to pull at least 10 cycles from that side. That is income. That is how you build something sustainable and lucrative because we can go out and, and we can make, uh, in 200 bucks right now we can by, by rolling up our sleeves impacting lives in our retail and I, and like i said i love that but retail is one time and when we talk about building something sustainable we want something that is residual the residual income so going back to team builder it's diamond for six weeks 
with 25 leadership points, and I'll explain what those leadership points and how you earn them in just a second, molding a coach to Emerald for the first time this year with 1,000 volume on the weak leg. Let me see if I have any questions before I move on. Team Shine, yes. He said, yes. Okay. Uh, okay, all right. So if you guys have questions, just let me know. But at the diamond rank, you'll begin to see all of these benchmarks and you'll see check marks next to the different categories that you've already um, checked off. Um, so you'll see in the back office, you'll see team builder checked off and, and some of those, excuse me. I just realized that it went ahead a couple slides. Let me go back really quick to team builder. It went way off. Okay, so <laughs> once you reach Team Bil uh, Diamond, and for six weeks, you'll see that checked off. And 25 points, checked off. The Emerald, checked off. The 1,000, checked off. And you'll see this in your back office. We'll recognize you, but then we'll also be sending you a, a piece of this plaque, um, which is super cool. It can be a paperweight or a, a trophy piece. But we'll be sending this to you automatically. And then once you reach team leader, team leader just takes it to the next step, the next level. So now we are diamond that's helped one person reach diamond two. So we're one star diamond or higher for six weeks with 50 leadership points, molding two coaches to emeralds for the first time this year or one coach to diamond for the first time with 2,500 volume on your weak leg for, for five weeks. So that's 2,500 total for the five weeks, not 2,500 each week, which again, translates directly to income. And, and um, once you reach team leader, we'll not only, we'll do the same thing, you'll see all the check marks in your back office. Um, next to the categories, we will do the recognition, but then we'll also send you another little piece of the trophy that connects, which I think is so cute, connects, and a backpack, a team leader backpack. So we'll be sending this all to you just to celebrate you and your team making your way down the road to elite, which leads us to the next benchmark, which is premier leader, which again, we're just taking it one step further. So it's two star diamond for six consecutive weeks with 75 leadership points. And I'll explain again what those mean and how they, how you earn them in just a second with 5,000 volume on your weak leg and molding a coach for the, for the first time to diamond this year. So we'll do all the same recognition and you'll receive another little piece that's premier and then to elite so for elite you notice that for premier you notice that there was a 5,000 volume on the weak leg that translates over to elite also um, so the 5,000 the two new two coaches to diamond for the first time this year 105 leadership points which I'll explain what those mean and how we earn them in just a second and five star diamond or higher for six consecutive weeks and once you get that we'll send you the last piece of the trophy and a fun little topper so that's the trophy that's the road to elite program um just very basic i'm going to now explain how to earn those leadership points before i do let me just see if there are any questions um Yes, that bag is off the chain, Destiny, let me tell you. Does a coach have to be a new Emerald or someone getting their Emerald back who lost it? Okay, great question, Valerie. So for the categories where I say the uh, a coach to Emerald for the first time, they could have been a coach in 2014, but they need to have reached Emerald lifetime rank of emerald for the first time in 2019 so to answer your question it does need to be a new emerald not someone just getting their emerald back um yeah i love free goodies too okay abby yep yep okay you guys already knew it so let's talk about how to earn the leadership points there are three different ways to earn the leadership points. At the bottom of my slides, I have who affects these points. Um, so for this leadership APV, which stands for acquisition personal volume, the people who affect these points are your brand new everything. So your 2019 coaches and your 2019 customers. And a way for you to kind of begin to track this is by running your sponsorship drill down report weekly and just kind of keeping track of your 2019 coaches and your 2019 customers, the order that they initially come in with, but then any uh, subsequent orders after that. One thing I 
actually don't like about the title of this category is that it almost alludes that it's only from acquisition. And remember those three things that I mentioned at the very beginning. If you don't remember anything else, remember what I, do you guys remember what I said? Okay, I'll tell you. Acquisition, retention, and leadership duplication. So this category actually is acquisition and retention. And so the way that you'll keep track again is by running your sponsorship drill down report. You'll wanna filter it once you get that exported. And then you'll want to literally keep track of your 2019 coach and customer orders. There are <coughs> orders, but then any volume that they bring on after. So for this category, you'll earn one point every time those 2019 people uh, bring on a combined 500 per PV. So every time that they bring in a combined, a rolling total of 500 PV, you'll get one point. Candidly, if you're pushing for elite, this is the way that you <laughs> remember it. If you're pushing for elite, if elite is your goal, the goal should be having a monthly income goal of about 2,084 from your 2018, excuse me, oh my gosh, from your 2019 coaches and customers. Now, just to break down that 2,084, if we're talking just acquisition, transform 20, the deluxe kit, at the promo price, if we, stri if we strive for Success Club 10, so helping five people get started with that deluxe kit promo price, then we'll, we'll hit this 2084. So I don't want you to think that their number, these numbers are so far out that it's some, that at least something that you can't strive for because you just feel like you don't have time. Like these numbers aren't crazy. Um, if we're talking about acquisition plus retention, that same transform 20 deluxe kit promo price would be, excuse me, I, I said that backwards. I'm going to say, I'm going to finish this and come back to the first one would be success club 10 in that case. So five people, but then helping eight people stay on Shakeology or something that's equivalent to 90 PV or above. So for the bringing the acquisition and the retention, it will be success club 10. So helping five people get started with that deluxe promo, uh, the deluxe get the promo price, but then helping eight of your people, if we're already diamond and we're paid as diamond, there are eight, keep staying on Shakeology for, or something that's equivalent to 90 PV on HD. Let me go back to the acquisition only because I misspoke. And so for the acquisition only, it's actually Success Club 16. Success Club 16. So eight people, eight people with that, if we're talking acquisition, period, 2084 volume will come from Success Club 16. So maybe Success Club 16 is our new norm, but just know that these numbers aren't crazy. And this is also uh, a, a, something that we're going to ramp up as the year goes on. And so if you're like, whoa, I'm nowhere near that right now, that's okay. Because this is what we want to eventually average. And so come mid-year, we'll want to, as you are working on building your team, acquiring new people, helping them to stay on, um, to stay, to continue to get the results, helping them duplicate. As we're doing that, come mid-year, we want to then come back and see how we're doing with our average. But this is something that we'll want to start tracking now. So 2084 monthly volume goal per month from your 2019 people. And remember, your personal volume comes from your personal orders and your customer orders. So encouraging people to bring a friend to who's your accountability partner. You know, those are some great ways that you can help them also help customers get started. So monthly goal 2084 if you're pushing for a lead. The second way to earn your leadership points is through your leadership success club category and the people that influence this category uh, these are your 2018 and 2019 personally sponsored coaches so if you have accounts control controlled centers that you help um, to to build um, be mindful that any any coach that you place somewhere else that is not your personally sponsored will take away from from points in this category does that make sense so go for it, Christine. So say that, so like if I place someone in my third business center, they don't count? Yeah, so yeah, let me, let me rephrase this. So in those, control, in those control centers, they're not yours. In control centers that are yours, yes. So if you have a PS coach in your fifth business center, they count because they are your personally sponsored coach. But if you have control centers that you help 
to build. Got it. Um, let's say, let's say you and your spouse built this together. Yes. He has his own account, but you guys kind of do it together. Yes. You help bring on coaches together. Um, but he doesn't really care about elite or ending anywhere along the road to elite, but you do. If you do and he doesn't, then be mindful. If it doesn't make sense financially, if, if it makes sense financially, do what you got to do, okay? <laughs> but if it doesn't make sense financially, then be a little selfish with the people that you bring on. We want them to be our person's yeah. first place, whether they're okay. your first business center or your third business center. We want them to be ours. That way we can bring them in, help them get results, help them learn how to share the results, and help them invite people to also get results. That way we're helping them buy into the success club culture, and maybe they're not hitting success of their first month. Hopefully they are, but if they're not, that's okay because this is also a category that's going to ramp up as the year goes on. But the way that we earn points from this category is each time your 2018, 2019 PS coach coaches hit success club, you'll get one point because we are leading by example. When you also hit success club five or 10, those points then double. So if you are pushing for elite, then the goal is to help an average of three PS coaches hit success club every month. And really, candidly, y'all, it's between two and three. <laughs> three Helping three every month will completely cap you out with an excess of 22 points in this category. So it's between two to three every month. But if you're looking at me and you're saying, well, I barely have one. Or, or I'm barely hitting myself. Start there. Start with you using the success club system uh, tracker. You know, get yourself to success club but invite people along your journey regardless as you're figuring this out too and then learn how to do it together and know that this is something that by the end of the year we want to have average and so if you're if you don't have any ps coaches right now hitting success club that's okay that is okay Let's continue to, to plant the seeds and do what we have to do to bring them on, help them buy into the culture. That way, come mid-year, we are beginning to see these numbers ramp up and that average increase. Any questions about those first two categories and ways to earn leadership points? Let me go look at my chat thread really quick. Oh, for some reason, it won't let me. Okay, I'll come back to that. I have so, a question. Yes, please. So, um, if I'm trying to think of this, if a person, I'm trying to figure out how to word this. Say you had a person that was a coach with you before and they quit whenever ago and they sign up this year. Do they still, they're a new coach, right? They still yeah. count as a new coach? Absolutely. As okay. long as they, as long as they sat out for six months, yeah. they coming in they are brand new so and that's kind of cool because they're brand new but they're coming in with everything that they knew before but all of their points and everything they will okay. count as a 2019 coach if they sign up this year okay okay so the final way the final category to earn those leadership points is through your ps1 plus success club which is a mouthful Oh, in my next slide, I'm going to give us a better way, in my opinion, to approach this category. But the people who influence these points are your brand new coaches. So your 2019 personally sponsored coach, coaches, excuse me. And you will earn one point each time your, your brand new coach earns one successful point in their first full month of coaching. Okay, I'm going to say that one more time and then I'm going to go to the next slide. You earn one point every time a brand new coach earns success one success the point in their first full month of coaching the first question i typically get when i share this category is well what is a first full month a first full month literally means their first full 30 days and so if they signed up today which it's what february 26th they have all the way until march 31st if they sign up on march 1st they have all the way until april 23rd, March, April, April 31st. <laughs> yes, I just counted my knuckles. Do not judge me. All right, so this is the way that I like to explain this category because I talked at the beginning of this conversation about how people who are striving to end along the road to elite, they're helping people in a holistic way, in a way that transcends beyond just health and fitness. And so the way that I like to approach this category is if someone comes to me and they say that they want this, they need this, like the business opportunity side, then my goal for them is to help them see a win right away. My goal for you is for you to earn commission 
from a challenge pack in your first full month of coaching. Why? Because I remember what that meant for me. I remember how that impacted my family. And, and, and maybe you didn't even think that you were going to be doing uh, running this business in the manner that you're running it now, but that $60 check because you didn't even sign up your, do your EFT. So that what 5750 <laughs> check that you received that, that, that physical check in the mail, that was the catalyst for you to, to begin to build this business in the way that you're building it today. That was what your family needed to see what was possible. Um, that was what you needed to be able to buy Pampers. I, I've heard the stories of people who are now in the Million Club who started this opportunity to buy Pampers for an extra 50 bucks a month for Pampers. So I think that if we can begin to change the way we approach this category, it will be one more fulfilling for us because it's really built on helping that new coach get started. Um, but two, it makes a little bit more sense as we talk about what this program means. And it means that we're helping people holistically. And so the goal, especially if you're striving for elite, should be to help at least one new coach earn commission from a challenge pack sale in their first full month of coaching. We can do that. And, and, and the quarterly goal, if you're striving for elite, should be to help at least one person earn their way to Summit every quarter, so every three months. And, and the reason why is because Summit is our must-attend event. It is the event that has changed hundreds of, of lives and businesses. It's an event where we not only get to um, hear from co top coaches who are building this business, sharing their best practices on how to build it. But we're also being recognized for the lives that we're impacting collectively and, and your team individually. And, and, and we get to see um, the Beach Body Challenge winners and, and hear their stories. And we get to rub elbows and connect with, with people that we maybe see 364 other days of the year virtually. Um, we get to see that this is real. We get to shut down the 13th city and the largest, uh, the 13th largest city in the nation and and work out right downtown like shut down one of their main streets to work out with 20,000 like-minded individuals we get to party and I mean like five-star parties I mean there are so many reasons we have world-renowned speakers who have changed the courses of people's businesses like Rachel Hollis I mean there are so many reasons to attend something why wouldn't our goal be to help someone who wants this because we can only control the controllable absolutely but why wouldn't our goal be for someone who wants us to help them earn their ticket there for free? Well, we got to talk about it. We got to let them know why and how it makes sense for their personal goals and then help them do the things to get there. So, but all of those categories, those are how you end somewhere along this road to elite. It ends you at elite. I also talked a little bit about volume. I just kind of want to go over volume really quick. Um, I put weak leg in um, quotations just because this is not necessarily just how you build weak leg volume. This is really how you build volume in its entirety. Um, but just remember these, these, these three basic things before I go into how to build volume in its entirety. Um, your team volume, as we're talking about sustainability, we're talking about being lucrative and building something that is going to last. We want to build that residual income. And that residual income comes from building a team. It comes from your team volume. And your team volume is, is the total volume produced by all of the coaches in your organization. And so your kids, your grandkids, your great grandkids, and beach body language. So your person sponsored coaches, your person sponsored coaches, person sponsored coaches, and so on and so forth. The total volume produced. And and really, it, co it goes back to those three basic behaviors, which is the acquisition, retention, leadership, duplication. If we are focusing on those things, then your volume will naturally build itself. If we are beginning to focus more on that leadership ladder as opposed to just diamond, remember, if your goal is just diamond, if you're not just, excuse me, if your goal is diamond, um, we no longer just want to be diamond. Diamond doesn't mean much, but what is does mean more than just diamond is team builder. If your goal is to is to strive to attend new leader conference next year, well, we know you need to be one star. Don't just strive to be one star. Strive to be a team leader. 
right? Because those mean more. They are building a more solid foundation. Um, that means that you are building a team. You're, you're duplicating your behaviors and, and your leadership. And all of that is what creates the sustainability. All of that is what creates something that is making money. We want to build this, build this business and we want to make it worth our time. And lastly, in regards to weak leg, is your weak leg can switch back and forth. And so at the end of the week, whichever leg was your weak leg is what we will pull from. Okay. And even if it switches from week to week, that's okay. We are just calculating, did it, did it add up over five weeks to 1000 or to 2,500 or to 5,000. So just know that your weak leg is the leg that has the least amount of volume, not the least amount of coaches. You can have a leg that has way more coaches on it than the other leg, but has less volume. And that's okay. But I just wanted to, I just want to make it unequivocally clear that your weak leg has everything to do with volume and nothing to do with body counts. But these are some ways that you go about building your volume. And again, I feel like I have said this so many times, but this is really what it is. And it's acquisition is bringing them on, but acquisition starts with you. And so if you yourself have not like jumped all in with this a program like from start to finish exactly how it's written documenting your journey sharing those those transformation pictures consistently like every week or every other week while you're in the midst of doing that program then start there and i'm not talking about you need to get some huge you know transformation you don't that's not what i mean but showing up Showing that it works, that's what we need to do. That's, that's what our goal is as we're talking about acquiring new people. And, and so as we're, as we're getting our results and sharing our results and sharing what we're doing and why we're doing it and inviting people to come along our journey with us, well, then we want to help them get results. And we want to encourage them to share their results, their transformation pictures, because you guys know what happens when you show your belly button. People are like, what the heck are you doing? <laughs> Sign me up. Anyway, so we, we want to help them and we want to encourage them to do some of the same things that you went about doing to help get them started. So the acquisition starts with you, but also it goes for us helping our, our, our people get results and share the results, but also finding fun ways to retain them and help them maintain their results and maintain their journey. Perfect. 21 days is over. Great. Let's get you started with our next program. This is a lifestyle. This is not a 21 and done thing. And majority of the people that you're bringing on are, can't, are for the most part, are starting for 365 days. They, they signed up for BOD all year you know, on demand all access. And so we want to make sure that they aren't just doing this 365 day lifestyle change for 21 days and then calling it quits. No, no, no. It's up to us as, their, as the coach to make sure that they have their next goal before their first goal ends. And we're finding fun ways to keep them on their journey um, and keeping them on Shakeology and, and introducing them to things that go beyond just Shakeology, like beach bars and performance line. Do they have their pre, uh, during post-workout? Are they, are they taking active? Like, do they have what they need? And as we talk about building volume, us ensuring that they have what they need is a great way for us to help them, but for us to also build volume. That's what makes our business more lucrative, the more that we help people. And your business has these things already ready for you to make sure that someone knows about so that they can get what they need, but also so that you can build something that's lucrative. If someone comes to me and this is their first time doing health or fitness, I want to make sure that they have everything, everything from, from the, the program that they're doing to their performance line, to their Shakeology. But if their cravings are strong, I want to make sure that they have a beach bar. If, if they have not done this before and they barely have any workout clothes, I want to make sure that they have their tights. I want to make sure that they have their sports bra, their t-shirt, their hat, their hat girl. And your business supports all of this. And there's volume attached to all of that. And so we just have to be willing to be the one-stop shop and not be, I don't know, timid to share that we have the solutions to holistically, to help them get started as soon as they get the package.
okay? So uh, introducing those products, retaining those coaches, introducing those coaches and bringing them on, but then also helping your coaches duplicate. One way, the best way to help them duplicate is identifying what their personal goals are. What are your personal goals? And, and, and you've heard me say this so many times tonight is because I think that it, Beachbody, go, it, it, Beachbody goals don't mean anything unless they are attached to your personal reason why you need to reach them. Beachbody is the vessel for you to reach your personal goals. So if you tell me your goal is diamond, why? If you tell me your goal is elite, why? What does that mean for you personally? What does that translate for your family personally? And so one way that you can help your coaches develop is to understand, help them figure out what their personal goals are, and then begin to identify very matter-of-factly with confidence what their beach body goals should be, which most likely will translate back to success club and striving to end somewhere along this road to elite in the next six to 12 months. And working deep within your team, as you're, as you're going to be bringing on coaches and as you're beginning to help people in a way that transcends beyond just health and fitness, because you're beginning to talk a little different and show, show up a little bit differently, there will be people that you bring on who just aren't quite ready. And that's okay. One, you're in good, you're in good company with that. There are some people who need a little bit more grace. Maybe you need a grace and that's okay. But let's say you brought in Sally and Sally brings in. Tiffany and Sally is not quite ready but Tiffany is well go link arms with Tiffany and go impact lives because your success in this business is directly aligned with the lives that you impact period and and volume comes from your entire organization and so while we're helping Tiffany technically we're helping Sally and and but really we're helping the team we're helping the team we're building a business that is sustainable. And most oftentimes what happens is because Tiffany's going, Sally all of a sudden wants to figure out what she needs to do to go also. So those are some quick tips in regards to building your weak leg volume. But again, all of these end somewhere along the road to elite. And so that's my goal for you is to, to have a number and, and to put what number you're striving for by the end of the year in the chat thread. I would love to see that. And, and, and one, of the, one of the biggest uh, characteristics of people who reach their goals in Beachbody is, is, is these people who reach their goals have their blinders on. And they have their blinders on in a bunch of different facets. But in this particular manner that I'm talking about is, I don't care if your goal is one, two, three, or four. But I want you to feel confident in what you say you want to strive for as it makes sense for you personally. So let me know in the chat what you're striving for. One, two, three, or four. And, and put your blinders on if you're like, well, I want to put two because that's something that I really want to strive for. But I know that people think that I should put four. So I'm going to, no, blinders on, do you. But while you're putting those numbers down, if you're striving for elite, here are some other benchmarks and dates to hit these goals by. These are, if we're starting from the beginning of the year. So if you're like, wait a minute, I'm not a team builder and it says March 31st, that's okay. One of the caveats in team builders holding it for six weeks. So there's some time that will have to happen if you're not there yet, but that's okay. Set your own goal, set your own goal. And then do all that you can to reach it. If we fall short, but you can say, I couldn't have given a fingernail tip more, we won. If you fall short and you say, uh, I could have probably did a little bit more, then you lost. So my goal for you is to identify what going all in means for you, your personal goal, and then where Beachbody fits in to the attainment of reaching your personal goal. And then set some dates for the benchmarks. That is the road to elite. I won't go over the elite ranking. I kind of alluded to it. I'll just share again. This is the, the $100 to $500 bonus. But really, elite boils down to those three categories. I, I've given you guys the goals if you're pushing for elite already. But more than all that, the basics of business building is acquisition, retention, and leadership duplication. Or to make it even more simple, uh, earn success club and advance yourself recruit coaches help them get results and help your coaches earn success club and advance 
that's really the name of the game. And so if you don't remember anything from our conversation, know that you can do it and know that chances are the things that you are going to be doing on a daily basis to help you build a sustainable, lucrative business that's based on impacting lives, you are going to be doing the things necessary to reach elite premier team leader, team builder somewhere along this road to elite. And so now let's set the goal and let's begin to work towards it. You've heard from me why. You've heard from me how. Now I'm going to just share this video so you can hear it directly from your cohorts. To call coaches who have worked so hard the previous year and be able to announce that they have accomplished their goal, their team goal, what they've been working so hard towards all year long, and be able to celebrate with them, ultimately, that they hit elite. We are excited to congratulate you and your family and your team on being a 2018 team. Oh my gosh. It's pretty awesome, guys. I don't even know what to say. This is maybe the most nerve-wracking day of my entire year. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe it. <laughs> it did not feel real until right now. <laughs> someone has their whole family you know their spouse you have their kids and they're all hugging each other and just making a huge proudest moment oh my god oh, awesome. wow 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 yay 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 I left her the whole first two years of her life and didn't get to see anything, um, anything she did, and I hated it. It is something that I longed for and didn't know that I could have both the business and the mom to these crazy, crazy things. Don't eat with candy. Don't touch your sister. When a coach decides to push for elite, I see an instant change in the way that they approach their business day to day, and it, it truly does bring a fire and a passion to them. In January, I was an Emerald coach, and one year later, January, we are five-star diamonds elite team. So our team has just done some work this year, and we have changed so many lives, and this thing has taken off and become to be so much bigger than I could have ever imagined it to be. I never quit. And I had a million reasons to quit on the goal. For me, it was like more of a thing I wanted to do just for proof of the network, you know, like that it doesn't matter what's happened to you, you can come back from whatever and it's how you choose to have it define you and, and what, how you choose to react. You have to not be scared to, to go to somebody and say, I believe in you and our team needs you and you can do this. Like you have to just like empower people from within. We are a four time elite team, team dream again. Woo! We are a 2018 elite team. Woo! Robin, Chelsea, Pearson, and Shred Nation is a 2018 elite team. My name is Elsa, this is May, Brody, Natalie, and our mom is a 2018 elite coach. Woo! My name is Keisha Fitzgerald. I'm the founder of Team Fit Foundation, and we are a 2018 Brita Elite Team. Woo! So there you have it. You heard it from me. You heard it from your fellow coaches. But if, if your mission is aligned with helping people achieve their goals to live a healthy, fulfilling life, in a way that transcends beyond just health and fitness. If your goal in this business is to build something that's lucrative and sustainable based on impacting lives in a major way, then your goal should be to end somewhere along the road to elite.
So I'm just going to take a look at my chat and if you have any questions, feel free to unmute yourself. So, okay, uh, let's see. I have a lot of questions actually. To cancel when I went in my head. Girl, you're amazing. Yeah, I, everything happens for a reason. Girl, welcome to your new beginning again. Uh, okay, look at you now. Boom, so excited. So, once my right leg passes up my left leg, I should start placing on my left. No, Destiny, that's something that is individual. And so I would definitely say get with your, your sponsor, get with Christine, get with myself, get with someone on the coach development team. That way we can take a better look at your volume based on what your personal goals are. That way we can make sure that you are maximizing your volume. So I don't want to say, yeah, start placing on the other side because maybe that doesn't make sense for what your personal goals are. Um, oh, and Christine just said the same thing. Okay, uh, like that, giving what they need, not selling, boom. Exactly, giving them the tools. Like I went recently to get my skis, um, um, like I don't even know what they call, like put the stuff to make them slide better. And I was like, oh, well, I need to get that done. I need to get my boots resized. I need to, I needed to get some new poles because I had bent one of my poles. And I was like, oh my gosh, Lord, I hope that I can just go to one place and they can do all this. And they did. I would have been mad, y'all, if I would have had to go to several different places. And that is us. We have this opportunity to be a one-stop shop. Most people who are coming in and they need everything, y'all, that is just going to be another hurdle and another excuse for them not to get started. Well, I have to go get this and I have to go get that. Wait, 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 I got it all. You got it all. Y'all got it all to help them today, right now. But we have to make sure that we're giving them the tools. Okay, one, love it, Megan. Let's do it. Abby four, Christine four, Alicia four, Nikki one. Yes, driving to one, but I'm happy to get to Diamond this year. And you know, I, Me Megan, I think that there's plenty of year left. Definitely strive for, for diamond because diamonds are part of it and then see see what happens see what happens as you're building something uh sustainable and as you're bringing people in um three love it oh wow courtney valerie destiny four nikki so it sounds like you guys have some some pause that you can even set up hold each other accountable you know i always say <clears throat> to rely on your team these are your people so like nikki and sue and and Nikki again. Megan, so you guys all be together, accountability partners. You guys are striving for four, and, and Megan, excuse me, go, go strive for four together, or excuse me, for one together. Abby and Christine and Alicia, you guys are all striving for four. Go strive for four together. Valerie and Courtney, you guys are striving for one. Link arms and hold each other accountable together. Um, if you get one star before six weeks is up for Diamond, how's that timing work? So if you get one star before your six weeks is up for Diamond, so I'm assuming, Destiny, you mean you're holding one star Diamond for six weeks and then you're paid as one star Diamond? Is that what you mean? I meant whenever I said that, like, if you get one and two star, kind of like similar times, not the one star and the diamond. Kind of. Yeah. So if you get, if you, let's say you go straight from diamond to two star and you hold two star diamond for six consecutive weeks, check off two star, check off one star, check off diamond. <laughs> so you'll see all those check marks in your back office once you read it. So yes, to answer your question. See, there are no words to describe getting that call. Yes, Emerald to five star. If she can, so can you. Like that, that is one thing that I really want to make so clear that if these people can, you can too. They are really no different. They have similar situations and they come from similar walks of, of life and, 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 and they truly are no different than, than anyone that I'm looking at on this call besides maybe they made a decision They've defined what consistency means for them, and they show up every single day, regardless of life happening. So it looks like um, one last question, Destiny. Six weeks for Diamond Hired, six weeks one star, so they overlap. Yep. Boom, boom, boom. Good situation to have. Absolutely, Christine. So it looks like I've gotten to all the questions. If there aren't any more, it's exactly seven o'clock my time, so that was exactly one hour. <laughs> Get out of here. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate you taking the time and doing this for us, Keyshawn. It's my pleasure. Christine, well, do you mind screenshotting those numbers so that we can just come back um, in a couple months and, and I'll just check in on the team? 
<laughs> yes. Okay. All right. So I'm going to hold you guys accountable too. All right. You, thank you for having me. I hope that this was helpful and I look forward to us impacting lives together. So thank you. Keyshawn. Have a good night guys. Thank you.